If you have an HP DesignJet ePrinter, you can benefit from all the advantages of HP DesignJet ePrint and Share, which allows you to access, share, and print your projects from virtually anywhere using a smartphone, tablet, laptop, computer, or ePrinter. To do this, it's very important that you follow four simple steps to configure HP DesignJet ePrint and Share on your ePrinter and PC. The first step of the process is directly on the ePrinter touchscreen and depends on the type of ePrinter you have. If you have one of the HP DesignJet ePrinters on this list, the process is initiated directly from an icon on the home screen. Alternatively, for the HP DesignJet ePrinters on this list, you need to run the connectivity wizard from the main menu and follow the steps it shows one by one. In all cases, there is a step in which you will be shown your ePrinter's email address. It is very important that you note down this address because you will need it to be able to print via email. Although the default address provided is normally complicated, you can change it later for an easier one to remember. You have now activated your ePrinter, so you can go to the PC. From here on, the setup process is exactly the same for all HP DesignJet ePrinters. Before continuing, make sure the computer is connected to the Internet. To start, insert the installation CD, if you have it. If not, you can download the software directly from the HP website support pages. You can always find the latest versions of our firmware and software here. When the installation wizard starts, press the Install button. Select the ePrinter you want to install and press Next. Make sure that all the items are selected for installation before moving to the next step. The progress bar indicates that all components have been installed correctly. The software installation process is very intuitive. The wizard guides you through the steps and you only need to press next until completing the whole process. Creating an HP DesignJet ePrint and Share account is very simple. During the installation process, you will be asked to complete a short form directly on the HP DesignJet ePrint and Share website. After finishing, press Create Account. If you already have an HP DesignJet ePrint and Share account, simply press Skip to skip the registration on the website process. After pressing Finish, you are informed that the software has been successfully installed. There is another way to create an HP DesignJet ePrint and Share account without using the installation driver. Just use the web browser to access the HP Graphic Arts portal in this URL. Press the option Create Account and fill in the blanks. You will receive an email confirming your registration. It is very important that you press the link shown on the email to activate your HP ePrint and Share account. The fourth and final step for being able to use HP DesignJet ePrint and Share is linking an ePrinter to your account. To do this, log into the account, go to the My Printers section, and press Add New Printer. In the box that appears, you have to enter the email address provided in Step 1 when enabling the web services from the ePrinter touchscreen. The HP DesignJet ePrint and Share setup is easy and intuitive and gives you access to a world of possibilities.